Hello all, uh, presenting this small paper. Uh, it's very important paper because as you all know that we use folic acid supplements uh, along with multivitamins very routinely in day to day practice. And also what happens when this uh, folic acid supplements are given in cancer patients? That's a question. Okay, because you know that uh, uh, the uh, synthesis of the nucleotides uh, happens through a uh, folic acid pathway where uh, uh, folic acid is consumed. And so that was the hypothesis that does folic acid use while cancer uh, causes increase in the, the uh, progression of the disease so they did this study uh, Michael Moody et al they did this study they used uh, uh, this uh, folic acid on the cells and uh, I, I'll be telling you the results directly so that they should not be it should not be cumbersome for you they used actually HPV and folic acid both to check their effects on normal cells and cancer cells okay for normal cells they took hepatocyte growth uh, sorry uh, uh, they took uh, hepatocyte uh, growth factor cells and for uh, cancer cells they used some uh, uh, CAL27, SCC25 and SCC15 cells okay so what they found was what they did was they tested these two things the HPV and the effect of folic acid individually and then together on these cells okay and that they found out that uh, it the folic acid I'll, I'll be telling you about folic acid specifically it didn't affected the normal cells much but the folic acid uh, causes increase in proliferation of these cancer cells okay when you give the folic acid supplement in cancer patient it have shown in this study that it increases the proliferation of cancer cells it also reduces the uh, replication of p53 genes p53 something which prevents cancer so it uh, down regulates the p53 also so and along with hpv it can uh, show synergistic effect like it can uh, uh, accelerate the cancer growth okay so but in the normal cells in the normal cells if it given like the folic acid if it given in normal cells it didn't show any uh, like much of a uh, proliferation so yeah this is the uh, conclusion of this study that folic acid if given in normal patient may not show uh, cancers uh, uh, like may not predispose the predispose the patients to cancer formation but if folic acid supplements are given in cancer patients it might proliferate them this thing and particularly in oral cancers where this study have been done uh, i i did uh, reviewed similar